Today, we'll be going over how to simply install these professional movie titles that you can use for your music videos, corporate commercials, vlogs, etc. They are drag and drop presets to make your life easier. Here on the screen is our website, www.b3-studios.com, where you can find plenty of Final Cut Pro plugins. Some are free. Yes, some are free and some you have to pay for, but all in all, they will help and enhance your Final Cut Pro workflow. So if you guys have a chance, go check that out. Now let's get right into the video for today. Once you download the movie title pack, it will come in a zip file and you will just need to open the zip file and it's going to be B3 Studios movie titles. And you're just gonna move this folder to your motion templates. I've already done this, so there's gonna be another folder here. So, and I'm gonna drop this in my title. So you're just gonna drop it in your titles here. It's already here, right here, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, but once you drop that there, your titles will appear in Final Cut Pro. Once the movie titles are downloaded, you will see those in your titles here under B3S Movie Titles. And there are 25 different cinematic movie titles for you to choose from um, some are corporate some for movies some for documentaries but i'm going to show you examples of ways that you can use these just the parameters between these so let's just go ahead and get started and let's jump right in okay for our first example we are going to go the corporate route so we're going to go one of my favorite ones is movie title seven so um, let's just play this clip out. So it's pretty much a corporate commercial. And we're just gonna add our font to this. So drag and drop your movie title up here. And voila, this makes it look way better. We can uh, adjust according to the presets. And I'm just gonna add a quick transition here just to show you how you can smoothly implement a transition. How that came in was very smooth. And we're gonna kinda chop it down. Gonna chop it down, break it off right here. Command B to break. And what we're gonna do here you can see the title, but if you want it a little bit clearer, we're going to add a drop shadow to make it even bolder. And you can make adjustments as well as far as the color if you want. You can change the color of it to give it a nice little pop. Um, we can also adjust if you click here on the specific title. We can mess with the tracking, make it look even more cinematic, as well as here. Or I can just go here, just click around it, and then we can adjust the tracking of it. So it's a simple drag and drop to make your film look even more professional. And you can create whatever you want here. You can put a custom anything. Let's put super opening or something like that. And then you can just change whatever you want down here as well. Um, let's say super restaurant. Restaurant. All right. And we can just play that right here. Just giving you guys an example of what this could look like. Easy drag and drop that is very professional. So that is one example out of the 25 movie titles uh, that we have. Um, like I said, you can adjust parameters here and make it a color that you want and any specific wording that you will want here. Now let's move on to the next title. Okay, now we're gonna go to our next clip. This can be used for movies, shows, documentaries, things of that nature. But this one is another one of my favorites. This is movie title 13. And we're just gonna implement this here. I'm gonna add a cross dissolve to my title to bring it in smoothly. And we're gonna, we're gonna play this back. That looks really nice, really professional. 
really professional right there. So, like I said, we can make adjustments as well. So, um, depending on what color you would want the title. Um, we can make it any color we want. Or we can make it a teal color. We can make it a teal color. Uh, like I said, we can change the title. Let's make it um, main event. All right. And this is a perfect example. You see how far spread out it is. We can change the scale of this and bring it down to here. And we can play this back. Looks really good. And you can change, like I said, the adjustments here. You can change the colors of These subtitles here, give it that, the same touch, or you can kind of just do whatever you want to do. Just be creative, right? Um, you can take things out. You can take this out if you want. Erase that. And just slowly put that there. It's totally up to you. Um, you can even add a drop shadow if you want to make it pop out even more. I'm going to play this back one more time just so you can get a good look. So, yeah, guys, this is another one of my favorites from this movie title pack, movie title 13. I use this a lot in my own personal work. Very easy to use, very convenient for video editing um, for professional film titles. Now, let's go to the next example. All right, guys, so our next movie title is for specifically vlogs but you can use this to your creativity um so i'm just gonna play this and this is movie title 12 and i'm just gonna drag and drop that onto our timeline and as you can see this is looking really good already um so i'm going to make adjustments to this here a, let's put a day in let's lower the font a bit and center it and then we can adjust it here and we can put the tracking right here make adjustments as you want a day in Mexico, center it, make adjustments here, um, John's vlog, right, and let's add a cross dissolve to the beginning and the end, and we're going to split it right here so it's not so long. And let's play this back. <clears throat> Looks pretty good right here. We can also make adjustments here. We'll put this on top if you don't like the way it looks. Looks nice, looks nice. And now we can just, to make it look even better, we can add drop shadows to each. And if your drop shadow is too, has too much depth, we can make adjustments there because I see this is popping out a little bit more that, than I would like. So we can go down to our drop shadow and we can adjust the distance. So I'm gonna put this at around 1.8 and I'm gonna put the opacity all the way up. And we're actually gonna change the color of this Mexico to make it a different color. 
we can go this kind of green. And let's play this back. Looks pretty good right there. Still make adjustments. Let's take the drop shadow off now. Actually, I'm gonna put it back on. And I'm gonna put the distance at one. So that looks good, guys. Like I said, you can make adjustments according to how you want it. Um, this is just a preview. Uh, we can make it yellow. Let's make it yellow. I think that looks a little bit better. Yep, it looks a lot better. And yeah, this is pretty much the film title that I use for vlogs. And you can use them for, you know, pretty much anything. Instagram reels, things of that nature. Um, but yeah. Uh, this is movie title 12. Now let's move on to the next. Okay, this next title, I usually use it for movie trailers, uh, music video trailers, things of that nature. But here's our clip here. And this is movie title 17. Um, I'm just going to play this through so you can see what's going on. This looks very professional. Uh, very intriguing to the user. Um, you can make adjustments like we have in the past. Uh, change the color, right? We can add a drop shadow if we want. Um, we can change the actual title. Let's make it something like trouble. Yeah, guys, you can just make the adjustments that you want here. Um, you can put anything as far as the cast that you want. I'm going to put B3S presents. And yeah, you can make it however you want, really. Um, totally up to you. The parameters are here for you to adjust and to make your life easier. Um, you can change one type of line color if you want. You can change the whole entire um, thing. It's totally up to you. Um, yeah, guys, so... Um, if you have any questions about this, you can drop any questions in the comments uh, and I'll be sure to answer those questions for you. Um, I hope you enjoyed this um, pack. It is on sale now. Um, it will be on sale for a week and then it will go back to its regular price. So make sure you guys are quick to get this. This is a really good plug in to save time um, and make your work look professional. Um, at the same time. So um, this is a great plugin that I use uh, pretty much every time I video edit. Um, I can just drag and drop a professional title, professional movie title, film title, corporate title um, onto my timeline and make adjustments. And uh, it saves me a lot of time and I know it will save you guys a lot of time. So thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, um, please feel free to comment and um, go check out the website www.b3studios.com where we have plenty of other plugins some free some you can pay for um, but all in all they will help your final cut pro workflow all right guys thank you so much for tuning in and i will talk to you guys soon okay thank you bye